Hey everybody, welcome back. Here's my tote that I talked about in a couple of videos of my old purses and whatever. I have no idea what's in here. I know that uh, my my dupes and all of that are upstairs in my little girly corner. And whatever I have left in here, I have no idea. I don't know. So we are going to find out what's in here. That's why I'm not up in that room. I'm downstairs because that's where this is. So we're kind of near my little nursery, my other channel stuff. So don't mind that if you see that in the background. But this is where I usually film that stuff. So we'll try not to be too distracting here. Let me put on a light. I'll put a light on the subject. Okay. First off is this bag. And this is my grandbaby. This is my grandson, Blake, and me when he was little. He's so cute. He's grandma's boy. But he is going to be 15 this year, 16 this year. It's crazy how much they um, grow up. So in here, there are, I think I put all, yeah, I put all wallets in here. Oh, there's one in here. Here's a pink one. That if I want to do another pink, has a couple of little marks that I'm sure will come off. I have... A white one which I don't know why I didn't get rid of it because it's ripped but I like it this is like how big I need to have my wallets and it needs to be cleaned I could probably refix this but I could probably I can still use it but there's a white one but I've changed out and using my my dupes so I probably won't use any of these again. Here's my, I used this one for the longest time and it has a ton of stuff. That's just one side and it used to have snaps. It used, it's probably in here. It used to have, um, uh, you could carry it. And then on this side it has that and then it has a, this one broke too so I don't know why I keep these things but I do in case I find another one I like I don't know and oh, I got this one year for my birthday from my hubby because I'm a big Elvis fan I love Elvis and he got me a Elvis wallet which I've never used <laughs> it's still I've never used it I love it though it's a it's a collector's thing. Here's another black. Most of my stuff is going to be black and white. I've had this one for a while. I think I got this at um, oh Walmart, maybe. It's genuine leather. It says genuine leather. I won't get rid of this one. Here's another white one. I love this one, too. And it still has the checkbook in it just needs to be cleaned but yeah and it has this kind of I don't know what kind of it's real leather I don't know what brand it is because it doesn't say anywhere on it what brand it definitely needs to be cleaned so I like I'll keep this one too so I should only keep and get rid of those ones. Oh, this one I bought. I went through a, a cloth wallet phase. I got this at Walmart, I'm pretty sure. This is still hooked to it. That's still in it. I don't think I used it that often, but it's way cute. Needs to be cleaned. Um, oh yeah, I went through a stage. These were pretty popular. I don't know if Anybody remembers these? Dating myself, I guess. <laughs> but this one's pretty cute. I have too much stuff to put in here now. And here's my, I went through a zebra section and here's a pink thing on there. 
That same thing, I probably got it at Wally. Has my address and stuff in there. So that one's cute. Um, oh, okay. Now I'm going to go into a history, way history. Um, some odds and ends things in here. And this, I don't know what this goes, is, I think, I don't know if I still have this purse in here, but there's a, I can't even move it. <laughs> Let's see. There we go. Keychain. It's pink. Wristlet. Um, okay, these, all of these are back, way back, 80s, okay? Yes, I do still have some of these things. Okay, even further than that, probably. No, probably 80s, because my oldest son is 38, and I got this stuff around his birth or a little bit later. I was still in high school. So let me uh, show you this one, and let me dig it out. We'll do this now. I can find it. Okay. My very first purse I ever had. I still have it. It's old. It's vintage. I um, I love black, as you can see. Here's my makeup case. It's leather. It's real leather. There used to be a store in our town called Schillerif's, and they sold leather goods and a bunch of other stuff. So I got my first couple purses from there, and I got this from there. It's my first makeup bag. And I had a fringe thing going on that I loved. So when I bought my purse, I undid the stitching here because it didn't come with this. I put the stitching on there. And wow, this is old, guys. And it's still in real good shape. It's not moldy. It needs to be cleaned. The zipper still works. It's, it's awesome. I used this in high school that I spent in high school. Yeah, I used it quite a bit. I was a lot skinnier then, a lot smaller. But these, this is my first purse. And then the second purse I ever got, I wish I still had. I do not have it. I wish I had it. It was called, well, it kind of looked like a, a bucket purse, but it was really skinny. It was probably a little bit taller than this in a, in a square. And it had the two, like a backpack, you know? It was like that, and I had a black one, and it's gone. I don't know what happened to it. It's gone. I wish I still had it, but I don't. But this is my first purse, and it's old. It's like, at least Sean was born in 82. I was 16, so it's at least that old. I can't remember if I had it before him or after him. I think after but it was 1980s, the 1980s, so vintage. And this little one is 80s too, but late 80s. My girlfriend, me and my friend, the one I talk about a lot, we each had one, actually there was three of us, and we each had one of these because we used to go out. That was when I used to go out, and then we each got one of these because it was it kept our license in cash and we could put it on crossbody. I kept it. It's m memento stuff. And then same with this. She had gotten me this, and it's a little um, Chinese thing. I don't know what I put in here. <laughs> the only thing that would fit in here is some change or whatever. I have that. And lastly, my other makeup bag. It is leather also. And I used to use this one all the time too. This one does have a tag in it. Wilson's leather. Yep. 
So, and the zippers are still good. So these are, these are way old. This stuff is way old. I'll never get rid of that. I'll keep that. Okay, so that's it that's in that bag. So let's go on to this. I don't know why I haven't got rid of this because the strap broke right here. And I should just get rid of it. But it's so pretty. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Nice big tote. And I haven't got rid of it because I do like it. It'd be good to put in a camper. It needs to be clean, but the the leather strap broke. I mean, I could shorten them so they're longer, but I don't know. There's there's one. I love that one. Okay, these. Well, let's see. Here's another purse type thing. It used to have a chain with it, and it's kind of like a wallet kind of deal. Got that. I don't know why I still have that. Okay, this is my Chloe bag. I love this bag. Okay. And it says Chloe right on here. And it needs to be heavily cleaned. And this is leather. But I love this bag. I used to use this bag all the time in the summertime and it needs to be cleaned i've got marks on it up here and this thing is so heavy i don't even know where the key is anymore um i, I know i don't have it in here Ugh. but there's a penny <laughs> this goes through here so you can lock it but, um, yeah, inside. Here's the key, right here. So, it's a cool bag. I love this bag. So, this is my Chloe bag. And it should go upstairs with my other stuff. But, I don't want to... It is missing our stone right here. One of these metal pieces right here. But, I don't care. Actually, it's missing it over here, too. And, it's got feet on the bottom. But I don't care if it's missing that. I still love this bag. And I have this bag. This is a Gucci. Yep, says so Gucci, made in Italy. This is, um, I believe it's a replica. I don't think it's a the actual thing. But I love these kind of... To this day, I still kind of love, it's like a, but it has a snap here. Um, the only place that it says Gucci is right in the front, right there. But I don't keep these upstairs because there's no room. So I don't think it says anything on the inside. And it's just a big hole on the inside. It has a couple of. I'm pretty sure this is a, a duplica. So, my Chloe, my Gucci. What else do I got? Okay. My other one. Love this one too. My arm's getting sore because these are kind of heavy bags. <laughs> this is a, a D and G. This is a um, Dolce and Cabana one, and it has a, I don't, I lost a little zipper thingy here, but they have them, there's, yeah, there's one missing here too, you can still close it and stuff, but right there, right here, there's no holes, no, nothing in here. It's still in, I should probably try to sell it. And then there's a, a big, I don't know why it does that, because you, you can get stuff there, or you can open it here. And it reaches the same way. But here's another 
little purse, and it has the strap. It's cute. Oh, I have that one. And let's see. Oh, I have a little backpack. I actually went through a phase where I didn't want to carry anything anymore. And I went through a phase where I just used a little backpack. So there's my little backpack. Just a little one. There's nothing in it. I think Ariel, Ariel's used it a couple times. It's cute if you want to go hiking. Like, I should put it in the camper. So if you want to go hiking, you put a water bottle in here or whatever. I should put that in the camper. That's a good idea. I will do that. I'll put that in there. Another... <laughs> I think Jeff got me this for my birthday one year. I can't remember. But here's another one of these. Um... I'm not totally f fond of it, but what is it? Genuine leather. So, it, ooh, it smells good. It, it is leather. I love the smell of leather. So, and I have this one, this Indian one. I found a couple of things I could put on Poshmark. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, here's that strap that you... You um, snap in uh, that wallet I was telling you about. There's the snap for it. Um, checkbook holder. It's got stuff stuck to it. I save these just in case I need need one. Okay, another leather piece. This is old too. I've had this for a long time. This is um, kind of like a. Uh, fanny pack. You put it around you. You can put it through your waist. I didn't never used it as that, but it's a little brown leather little thing. So that's cute. I've had that forever too. My leather pieces. And then a white purse. This is old. I was using this purse when me and my husband met. And we met in 1990, 96. And it's, it's hammered quite a bit. It's one of these. It needs to be, it needs to be cleaned. But I don't think I'll keep it. So I'll donate that one. Oh, well, what else? That's it, just a bunch of bunch of straps and pennies that's it so that's it yep all right thanks for watching guys that was fun I'll put this stuff back because I probably won't get rid of it but I won't need that that big huge tub so maybe I'll use this for something else and put everything else in um, another bag and get rid of it so there we go i'll never get rid of this though and so that's so cute he's so cute he's huge now so anyway thanks for watching guys and i will see you in the next video i know